Intrigued by the next frontier in fashion technology? From AI text to video to cutting-edge AI discoveries, join us on this exciting journey as we bridge the gap between technology and style. Find out. Welcome to the 360 Fashion Podcast where you'll get the week's top 10 most important news items in the realm of fashion and technology. I'm your host Anina Nett, the founder of the 360 Fashion Network. I read hundreds of news items from fashion, augmented reality, virtual reality, wearables, robotics, textile innovation, and futurism every day. I choose the most critical items to summarize for you saving you time so you can focus on your business. Listen and subscribe to receive this roundup regularly. Now let's jump right into it. First, Google's new AI text-to-video tool is fun to look at. But what next? It's called Lumiere and it can whip up moving images like fluffy baby sloth with an orange knitted hat trying to figure out a laptop. Not too shabby. Lumiere's capabilities include text-to-video and image-to-video generation, as well as stylized generation that is, using an image to create videos in a similar style. Other tricks include the ability to fill in any missing visuals within a video clip. Nevertheless, video editing tools hold a lot of promise. Using a source video in prompts like made of colorful toy bricks or made of flowers, users can purportedly change the style of the subject completely. And with inputs like wearing a bathrobe, wearing a party hat and wearing rain boots to add said items to an image of, say, a baby chick, Lumiere may very well make fiddling with videos more accessible to those of us who didn't major in graphic design. News source, CNET, Occutex launches enhanced DigiLoop AR headset virtual and augmented reality device manufacturer, Occutex Technologies is launching an enhanced model of the OR lens surgery headset. The surgical loop device is designed to enhance a surgeon's vision during spinal surgery through the use of augmented and extended reality XR. The add-on brings additional functionality to the OR lens surgery headset which Occutrix Technologies says is currently in the clinical assessment phase as a part of its Orbot 3D surgical visualization theater aimed at transforming ophthalmologic procedures. The augmented reality AR device works by displaying 3D holographic images of the surgery site and is also designed to address a small procedural issue with the use of traditional loops, allowing for the lenses to be adjustable and digitally alterable to increase comfort for surgeons using the device, whereas a traditional loop requires surgeons to maintain a specific position, further stressing a delicate surgery. News Source, Medical Device Network RCheck offers automated cleaning with AR. RCheck is revolutionizing the cleaning industry with its pioneering software that combines augmented reality AR and artificial intelligence AI developed from extensive research. RCheck's innovative platform digitalizes and automates cleaning tasks, making them more efficient, effective, and high quality. It provides intuitive work instructions in multiple languages, catering to cleaners with varying language skills and technical knowledge. AR technology in our check aids in professional cleaning by ensuring thoroughness and consistency, regardless of the cleaner's experience. The app's AI component plays a crucial role in identifying and visualizing invisible contamination, crucial for maintaining hygiene standards in sensitive environments like hospitals. It also ensures the correct use of cleaning materials, thereby preventing cross-contamination. Our check is expanding its reach by developing a consumer version designed to make cleaning more engaging for individual users. This hands-free, immersive app supports workforce inclusion and integration. As the commercial cleaning services market grows, our check stands at the forefront, shaping the future of the cleaning industry with its innovative approach and commitment to sustainability and efficiency. News source, Trend Hunter, electric SUV Olympian Model 84 projects its augmented reality display on the windshield Olympian Motors is combining the past and future by presenting the Model 84, describing it as the first electric convertible SUV in the U.S. The electric vehicle comes with an augmented reality head-up display projected on the front windshield, replacing the 2D digital screens typically found in commercial cars. So far, Olympian Motors whose Model 1 also combines the aesthetics of the retro age with digital technologies, says the first batch is set to be delivered in the second quarter of 2024, and only 310 units of this convertible Model 84 will be produced. 
The electric SUV says goodbye to the crowded cockpits as the design team provides intuitive UX and removes 80% of the buttons and switches found in a typical driver cockpit. These are replaced by the augmented reality head-up display flashed on the front windshield, and the system is powered by the in-house Olympian operating system. The OS centers around voice commands to control the infotainment, HVAC, seats, doors, and lighting systems so the drivers can focus on driving. News source, Design Boom, Lady Gaga, Moogler, and now Psyche, Nicola Formichetti brings high fashion to Web3 Nicola Formichetti, the stylistic brains behind Lady Gaga's infamous meat dress and former creative director at Moogler and Diesel, is moving into digital fashion. For My Kitty took the title of digital fashion platform Psyche's artistic director, a role in which he will enhance Psyche's presence at key fashion and help expand Psyche's universal reach beyond the tech realm. I joined Psyche captivated by its vision for a future where digital and physical fashion worlds coexist, For My Kitty tells Jing Daily. We're creating a dynamic space where digital innovation meets traditional fashion, forging an exciting new path in the industry. He will also be responsible for nurturing emerging talent through the Psyche Collective. With years of experience in the traditional fashion space under his belt, For My Kitty earned his reputation as one of the industry's most thinking changemakers. The former fashion editor began working with Lady Gaga in 2009, styling the pop superstar in notoriously viral ensembles including the MTV Awards Meat Dress and the Grammys Exsuit. He has also worked in both creative and artistic director roles at Diesel and Moogler, as well as a stint as fashion editor at Vogue in Japan. For Mike Eddie will remain an advisor for the singer's beauty label House Labs, and as creative fashion director at Uniqlo, alongside his new position at Psyche. The tie-up marks an optimistic milestone for the digital fashion community. Having the backing of one of the industry's most lauded insiders will likely spur more traditional style devotees to pay attention to the burgeoning arena. Alice Delahant, founder and CEO of Psyche, also describes for my Caddy's appointment as a new chapter for Web 3.1 in which it can finally cement its status as more than a fad. News source, Jing Daily, here are the week's top 5 news. If you want to get the full top 10 fashion tech news items of the week check out our new podcast 360 Fashion or go to 360fashion.net podcast or search for it on your favorite podcast platform. Don't forget to subscribe so that you won't miss our latest episode. Get to sub